Hello friends, welcome back to another video here on the channel. I hope you're all doing great. For anyone new to the channel, my name is Lee, also known as Osiris. And in today's video, we're gonna be discussing a lot of issues some of you have been having with the duplication glitch, the cloning glitch that's been going around, going crazy at the minute, everyone trying it. And a lot of you have been having problems with it, either that by having a bad egg that you can't get rid of, having a black screen, having game freezes, and a lot of issues along the way that are making it uh, not as enjoyable a glitch to kind of me maybe doing as it should be. So in this video, because we have put a video up already about the cloning glitch, we're gonna just discuss all of the issues and show you some other methods and ways to go about this cloning glitch so you don't get any issues going forward. So let's hop into game. What we wanna do is just show you how to avoid the black screen uh, in the first place. So what we want to do is have a couple of Pokemon in our party. We've got obviously the Cresselia there with the Master Ball or something that we're going to be um, cloning and we've got kind of just a, a Pokemon that we don't, the, the sacrifice Pokemon that we want to be getting rid of because to do this we're going to need at least another Pokemon in our party. So I'm going to set the glitch up, go into the check summary of the Pokemon and we want to be hitting, remember it is Z. Uh, ZL, ZR and A all at the same time. So hit those three buttons at the same time. And that should set up the glitch. So when you exit out of here, you get this menu overlay over everything else. So you wanna just hit B, hit B, hit B, hit B, and then you're here in the other world. Don't hit B on this or it'll deactivate the glitch, okay? So you can see that we can run around. If you've been doing this glitch already, you'll know about it. What we wanna do is go into the battle. And the issue that people have been having with the black screen is hitting into the Pokemon boxes before the battle's loaded. So on that white screen or before it, been hitting into it, let's see, we'll move Cresselia and then we'll come out of here. You see, we're still in the battle there and then we'll run, we'll run, okay? Oh no, we've got the black screen of death. The black screen of death, here it is. And people have been experiencing this all the time, all the time, and it is an issue. But it is because you're going into the, the, the you're going into the boxes too quickly. What you need to do is wait for that white screen to disappear from the battle. You need the battle to actually load completely, that white screen to go away, and then you can access the boxes and do all of the the glitchy things. But if you do before, then no matter what you do, you're going to end up with this screen right now. So we're going to reset the game, and we'll be back in. Okay, 20 minutes later and the game is eventually loaded and uh, we are back in the game again. So, we know what to not do for the black screen. You don't want to be clicking into any menu screen too early when the battle is loading. So you need to wait for that white screen to pass and the battle to fully load and then go in and do the, the glitchy stuff. If you do before then, you're always going to experience that black screen like we have done. So we're back at this, the point that we were before, we can see that we've got a Cresselia uh, Shellos still in the box. So what we want to do is, um, if some of you have created a bad egg, now with the bad egg glitch is pretty good. It's pretty, it's basically the fastest glitch out there. So you want to come into your Pokemon summary screen again, ZL, ZR and A at the same time to set the glitch up. If you've done it right, we haven't that time. Not every time, we don't get it every time. We'll try it again, ZL, ZR and A. We should get it. There we go. Okay, we got it. So, to create a bad egg, a bad egg, all you need is two Pokemon in your party like we've got now. Run into the grass, run into the grass. And at the same time when we are doing this, come on Pokemon, where are you? Where are you Pokemon? Here we go, we've got one. You want to be waiting till this screen right now is, is done, right? Once that screen's done, the battle's loaded, we're fine to go in and do what we want to do, okay? And you will not get a black screen, okay? So at this point, we want to just come into our boxes. Um, we want to clone Cresselia. So we'll take it out of the top. We're going to clone it, put it in our box, and we're going to just run from the battle. And it's as simple as that. Simple as that. We want to exit the grass. And what we're gonna do is just go into our boxes and you'll see the Shellos has disappeared, but we've got a Cresselia. So the Cresselia is there in the party and that is how to avoid the black screen all the time. Just let the battle load and you will be fine. You will not experience that battle screen, that black screen after the battle, after you exit, you will not experience any frozen screens after that. So just let it load, let that white screen pass the battle load and you can go into the boxes and do everything. So we've got 
a duplicate of our Cresselia here. Now we're going to create a bad egg. So we've still got the glitch active. We've still got that menu screen there. We want to go back into the grass. So we've turned that Shellos into a Cresselia. Um, and now battle loading, white screen passes. We can go into our Pokemon box. We can go into our boxes. What we want to do is just take this Cresselia here, move it into our party, okay? And then we want to just come out of this screen, run, and then we can actually just get rid of the glitch here. So we can get rid of this menu overlay here. Just press B, it will get rid of it. That deactivates a glitch. And what we want to do is just come into our party again. Now, you will see there is an egg with no HP, it has fainted. So this is a bad egg. Whatever you do, you can't get rid of it. So there is a way for you to manipulate this egg without the glitch active to duplicate Pokemon now, duplicate Pokemon and items. But be very careful from this step so that you don't want to go into the boxes and hit anything else other than what I'm telling you to do or the game will freeze, okay? So this is very important. So you go into your boxes now. The first thing to do, don't touch anything else. Hit Y twice to go to multi-select. This is the only way you can access anything in these boxes. If you do anything else in these boxes, other than go straight to multi-select, it will freeze your game instantly and you have to reset and come in and do it again, okay? So the bad egg is not there, but it is there. It is there, I promise you it is there. What you wanna do at this point to duplicate or clone the top Pokemon is just grab it, Go down two spaces, don't drop it on the egg, because even if you try, you'll not be able to. I can't, I can't drop it, I physically can't drop it. So you go down two spaces into that third slot and just drop it. Ooh, there's a Cresselia appearing. And then you want to just do it again. And maybe we'll do it again. You always want to avoid that last slot and do it one more time. There we go. And now we got four clone Pokemon and we can do it again 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 and you can see how quick this is to clone Pokemon Ooh, we can't yeah we can't we can't we can't take all five out <laughs> but you can see how quick it is to clone Pokemon and clone items and I said in my last video that that was probably the quickest method to cloning well, I think it was wrong. I think this is pretty much the most, the quickest and most effective method to clone in, in the games. But the issue is now that you're stuck with a bad egg, right? So what, you, what, what can you do to get rid of it? Okay. Now this is this is the this is the issue that a lot of us have had. So what we're going to do is just exit the boxes here. Okay. So what you do to get rid of the bad egg, you want to come, uh, so you can see it here in your party. You want to come back into your boxes screen. Remember hit that Y button twice, come across to your Cresselia and you're going to have to make a duplicate of whatever Pokemon you've got on your party. You need two of them in your party, make a duplicate. Okay. So you come out of this screen now. And what you want to do is activate the duplication glitch one more time. You can see you've got three Pokemon in your party. You've got whatever Pokemon you started with, the duplicated one, and then that bad egg. So this is a method to get rid of the bad egg. So you want to click on summary of Pokemon. You want to hit that ZL, ZR, and A button. Again, hopefully we've activated the glitch. Just exit out, B out. Yep, we've got it. So just B out of here. And what we want to do is go into the grass and wait for the white screen so we don't have that black screen issue. And then we want to come into the Pokemon, into the boxes, hit Y twice to get multi-select. You need to do this and then move that second. Okay, we need to do it quicker because um, <laughs> we need to move this Pokemon into the box and then we need to exit out. Yeah, if I, uh, okay, the battle hasn't finished. Okay, we're fine, we're fine. So yeah, basically what you wanna do is go into the box, multi-select on, move the second slot to Pokemon into the box and then come back out of here and then run. And you gotta wear safely, the egg will be there. You wanna just get rid of the glitch screen and then click into your boxes and the bad egg will have gone. And Cresselia, well, it'll have turned into a Cresselia and everything will be fine and you can just drop this in here and you've got all your pokemon 
you're going to be able to do whatever you would do normally you're going to have no issues and you're going to have all these clones duplicates and that is how you create a, a bad egg so to create a bad egg if you want to do this glitch really quickly it is by moving a pokemon when you've got the glitch active into your party but remember after that when you close that glitch the the, the overlay menu down make sure that you're doing everything with that multi select the green finger um and that is even when you're getting rid of the bad egg so and that will make sure that your great game doesn't freeze if you just follow all the steps that we've done in this video you'll be fine just make sure that you're letting the battle kind of um load properly that white screen's passing and everything will be fine so friends, I hope you found today's video useful. I hope you found the tips and, and what we went through in this video useful, especially if you have been having difficulties with the, the duplication, the cloning glitch that has been uh, coming quite popular these last few days. Um, and if you have been having issues with it, hopefully these solve it for you. Um, we have went over a different method in today's uh, episode and it's probably a quicker one than the other method that we discussed on our last video. But if you've had that black screen, at least we cover how to get around it in today's video. So hopefully that does help you friends. Right, thank you so much for tuning in. If you have enjoyed the video, I would just ask kindly if you would drop a like on it, if it has been helpful, of course. And uh, if you enjoy this sort of content and want to stay up to date with all of the new glitches that we're getting and all the other Pokemon content for Brilliant Diamond Shining Pill, do drop a sub on the channel and um, I will, it will be very appreciated. Of course it will. So have a great rest of your evening, friends. Thanks so much for tuning in. I'll see you all for another video very soon. So until then, bye-bye.